Welcome to Friday's Discipleship Empowerment Connection. My name is Dr. Humphreys and I just want to bring you a little thought from the scriptures today. Today we want to focus on the word thankful or thanksgiving. Up here in Canada, this is our Thanksgiving weekend and we want to celebrate Thanksgiving but also to celebrate Thanksgiving with you. It's interesting that the word thanksgiving means to express our gratitude, to bless or to give praise. And that's what we should remember this weekend. We have so much to give thanks for and so much to praise God for. And it's interesting that in Psalms 116, verses 16 and 17, it says, O Lord, truly I am your servant. I am your servant, the son of your maidservant. You have loosed my bounds. I will offer to you the sacrifice of thanksgiving and will call upon the name of the Lord. So as we read this, I see three things that stand out to me when it comes to the idea of thanksgiving. First of all, we need to realize who we are. He says, I am a servant of the Lord. And the reason why he can begin to give thanks to God by being a servant of the Lord, he says here that the Lord has loosened his bonds. That means before he became a servant of the Lord, he was bound up in the things of this world. And, and the world can, can bind us up in all kinds of things. And we can be, get locked into things that we can't get loose from. But when we become a servant of Jesus Christ, when we give our lives to Jesus Christ, he then releases us from the bondages of this world. And because of that, out of understanding what he has done, we now can also give an offering of sacrifice of thanksgiving. That's our second point. When we realize what God has done for us, then we can give an offering of thanksgiving. But this offering is not just an offering where we give finances, but it's actually a, an offering of, of sacrifice where we're giving up things of our heart, things of our desires, things of our want, and giving it to the Lord. And we're giving it to the Lord in such a way it, it's an offering of thanksgiving. It's an offering of praise. And I hope this weekend that we will offer up a sacrifice of praise. And then thirdly, he says, I will call upon the name of the Lord. Really, when you realize you're a servant of the Lord and that you're to give a sacrifice of thanksgiving to the Lord, it's, I think, fairly easy after that to realize that what we need to do first of all this weekend is just call upon the name of the Lord. Because when we call upon the name of the Lord, He hears our cry. He hears our call. And especially when He hears that we're not just asking, but now we're giving thanksgiving for what He has done in our lives. You know, we need to see who we are. We need to see what we should offer. And we need to call upon the Lord. I think those are three important things that we need to do this weekend is to come to the Lord and say, Lord, I thank you that I'm your servant and that you have set me free from the bonds of this world. I thank you, Lord, that I have an opportunity in the freedom in this country to give a sacrifice of thanksgiving. And I thank you, Lord, that at any time I can call upon you and you will hear my cry and you will answer. So I pray this weekend will be a weekend of great thanks, that you will be full of thankfulness unto the Lord for what He has done for you and what He will continue to do for you if you just trust in our Lord Jesus Christ. I pray that you will have a great Thanksgiving weekend and that the joy of the Lord may be your strength because you serve Him you sacrifice the thanksgiving to him, and you call upon his name. God bless you. Have a great weekend in Jesus Christ now.